zone if they finish. Tied to top the standings. Here's the three from Holiday, the leading three-point shooter in the conference. Elijah yeah. Brown, another three-pointer for Oregon. The celebration of life continues on the beat. As does the Bruin run. Not sure about that. As a pitcher drills another three-pointer. The skills challenge but I'm glad he came back from the game. Oh, that's a tough shot. Yeah, boy. How about Aaron Holiday? That is four three-pointers for him. Cutting. Here's Set Holiday for the offense. Another one is fifth. McIntosh answers wow. with a three-pointer. It's been effective so far. Wilkes for three. And really for UCLA, where would they be without threes? They've got 17 baskets. 12 of them have been three-pointers. It's a beautiful play by Aaron Holiday. I was responsible for those first one. Pritchard for a beautiful Three. shot. Peyton Pritchard. Brown driving and well and scores to give the Ducks the lead. They've scored the last 13 points. Here's Pritchard for three. Hit it! Oh, you love fast. Yeah, right. McIntosh takes it strong and Throw steps it home. Throw it down. Dana Holman has breathed life into his squad here. They were on the ropes. But Holiday's got it now for UCLA. Deep three from hands. On target. Holiday with three into the paint. The floater. Look, look. Bounces home. McIntosh spins. Finishes. To Brown. Brown steps back. Off balance. No good. Overtime for Pauly. And led Oregon, it was part of the Final Four team last year. It's Holiday oh. gets it and a foul. There were two buzzer beaters, one by Dylan Brooks, one by Lonzo Ball. But it may not be close here in the end with Thomas Welsh hitting a three on senior night. I get to go to the legend crunch. That's it, UCLA wins in overtime. Now 10 and five in conference play. Uh, Tom Welsh is Final night here at Pauley Pavilion and a big shot to help the Bruins win it.